here there is something that is actually a cadence. What is a cadence? Again, to remind yourself the, the definition is um, harmonic configuration that provides a sense of tension and release. That's a cadence. Our most common one, most famous one being the 5 1. In this case, minor 5 1, E7, A minor. There's another cadence inside this, which is this. If you play F major 7, this also wants to go to A minor. Can you hear, can you hear that tension and release? There is another cadence, which is sort of a more complex one, which is playing the flat six chord, which is the F major seven, then E seven, which is the five, and then the one. So we get F major seven, E seven, a minor and this this is where things start getting beautiful and inspiring really and giving a lot of ideas for arranging tunes uh rearranging harmonies and and soloing ideas that's the that's the main things we talk about from from now so now see how instead of a two five one you can play a flat six five one is a is a is an alternative to to the usual cadence that we are used to that 2 5 1 B have diminished E7 A minor played as flat 6 major 7 E7 or 5 7 and 1 this uh, happens in a few tunes actually it happens on night and day It goes to an A major after that, doesn't matter. You can, you, you can resolve to a major chord as a surprise effect, surprise sound. But see, this is from harmonic minor, minor harmony. See, F major 7, E7, going to A. So this, this, this reharmonization is something you can do with any tune. If you're playing a solo piece, or even if you're playing with a band, or if you Playing whatever you can rearrange it and in, when you see a two five one or even just a five one add that flat six major seven instead of the two and that flat six major, major seven is it sounds complicated when you say it, flat six major seven okay well, how do i find that is that it's, it's actually very easy you just go half a step above the dominant chord play that as a major seven and then play your dominant chord and then the one Example in the key of F, what is a 2-5-1 in the key of F? G minor 7, C7, F. Uh, by the way, this, these things, were, uh, the good news he, here is this works for both for minor and major 2-5-1s. It works for both. So again, <clears throat> a major 2-5-1 in the key of F would be G minor 7, C7, F, like Honisako Rose. It goes two, five, two, five, two, five, two, five, one. So you could change it up a bit. You could do two, five, two, five, two, five, flat six major, five, one. You can play that C sharp major seven instead of G minor seven. C sharp major seven, again C, you just go half a step above the dominant chord and then play the dominant chord. Uh, yeah, I'm playing it as a major seven, you can play it as a six nine, major six nine, you, you can use the gypsy jazz voicing, you see? Just a C sharp six nine, C seven and F. See how this is a more interesting two five one? And this is all from harmonic minor harmony. So again, Honisako Rose, a nice way of, of uh, comping on it would be... Mm -hmm. 
and you can literally do it on any tune. Uh, again, we I don't know why that keeps coming to my mind, but it's a good example actually. Stronger than me, we were talking about it with Damien uh, weeks ago. That's a, that's a good example. It's is is what is a G minor six or G minor, but it, it means G minor six because it's G minor six, A seven D minor, right? Why am I mentioning that G minor six? Because instead of E half diminished, the song goes with the G minor six as an inversion of it. Do you guys remember that? So this a G minor six is actually nothing but an E half diminished inverted. So it it it's a minor two five one basically, G minor six, or he E half diminished same thing. So da 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 two five one. How do we apply that idea on this tune? Well, again, find the dominant chord, go half a step above that, play the major seven chord on it, which gives us a B flat major seven, and the melody still works fine on it. Da da da. But see, it's an interesting sound. So sometimes you can change it up. So G, A, D, and then B flat. You can try it on minor tunes as well, of course. Uh, what is this thing called love since we're working on it? There, it starts with a 251, minor 251 in the key of F. Instead of G half diminished, C7, F minor, I can play what? C sharp major 7. C7, F minor. And then the next four bars are uh, 251 in C, starting off as a minor 251, finishing on as a major with a, with a C major. But again, D half diminished, G7, C major can be a flat major 7, G7, C major. Mm -hmm. 